happiness through curiosity on TRS Clips. What was it like being in his locker room? Oh, it was. I was awestruck. Even now, you know, I, I never managed to get comfortable because you always have seen him as a god, as an idol growing up. But it was great. I mean, I think he is one once in a generation or even more kind of a cricketer. So he had that presence, and everybody in Indian cricket loved him. Was it overwhelming being yeah, in that yeah, dressing room? Yeah, of course, room? it was definitely overwhelming. But uh, he made us very comfortable. At the end of the day, he is the god of cricket, so you you always were overwhelmed. Did you ever ask him batting doubts? Yeah, he used to help me a lot, even while batting in the middle. So he had. I mean, he is tremendous. There's no there no words for him. To be very honest, was he also able to predict the game like Dhoni Bhai? Yeah, yeah. yeah. definitely that was a big part of his batting yeah, huge part huge part of his batting i think somehow he knew what was going to happen or what the bowler was trying to do or going to bowl so he was he was great that way why doesn't that happen to all senior players like why aren't they able to predict the game after a point no everybody have very different styles in terms of how they have come up in you know in the game and what made them successful so I think these things only a few people can do, and they are they are a little apart from born above us. Born above us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. What do you think made him special, actually, as a player? Like, how? What was the reason behind his? I mean, success? I don't think anything made him special. He has made our country special. <laughs> he has True. put India on the map. Otherwise, cricket was. I think cricket ideally started with him. I mean, Indian cricket. to dominate such good fast bowlers abroad the indian team was not a great uh, side back when he was playing i don't think he had great partners to bat with like how now nowadays i think in 6 or 7 you all of them are really good so back then i don't think he had such great partners you know to bat with even then he was tremendous yeah who was the most intense fast bowler you faced in your whole career but it was difficult facing a person i mean <laughs> it's, it's difficult facing any fast bowler but yeah <laughs> no why why like the, the fans may not understand what you just said explain that also why is it difficult facing any fast bowler so i mean while while growing up i don't think there were such great facilities to practice fast bowling they were not that fast fast bowlers in india where you could go into the nets and face them so later on eventually when the bowling machine came when you have this uh, throw down sticks and all that now it's become much more easier but when i was starting or when we were growing up we had to you know wait play with some you know synthetic balls on concrete and some all those things to jugad fast bowling jugad fast bowling <laughs> but nowadays it's much easier and at that time uh, what paji did in international cricket was uh, unbelievable unheard of if you enjoy this video subscribe to trs clips for more